Hello again, wild campers. So, yesterday was the day of the protest at Cornwood. If you've seen that video from a couple of weeks ago, or whenever it was, probably my last video. I was only supposed to have been doing them one night. But to get for me to get to Cornwood, I have to drive past High Wheel Hayes and Jest Hall. And I can see the snow-capped peaks. And I just had I just had to get up there and have a have a play in the snow, have a camp. So on very short notice, I got tomorrow off. I've restocked my bag and I'm out again. Let's go! <laughs> yes! That last time, um, the time of the first rally at Princetown, we had a little bit of snow, but it wasn't enough to scratch that itch. I wanted more. It looks like I've got more. That looks pretty snowy up there. So that is where I'm heading. It's really not very often we see snow, so I couldn't I couldn't turn down the opportunity to get out and have another camp in the snow. Yeah. I've missed the best of it though. I'm a little bit late to the party because um, it was about midweek. Midweek it started coming down, so a lot of this is probably melted. But. I can't complain, it's still white and it's getting whiter and whiter the higher I go. <laughs> so, that's enough of me yapping. Let's get hiking and get up there. <laughs> yes! So. <laughs> like a kid in a toy shop. <laughs> Oh, how deep it is! <laughs> That's pretty deep snow. <laughs> awesome. Gotta love a bit of snow. Gotta love a bit of snow. Ooh. Oh, it's icy. It's ice under that. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. God. Ooh, I wonder if I can stick the tent right there. Or over there. Ooh. Where I've pitched it's not ideal it's not completely flat but it's flatter than where I was last night up on the show show top and I'm kind of halfway in between high wheel haze and uh yes tall yes tall's over there um it's quite windy up here there's not really a lot of, a lot of shelter and wherever there is shelter there's a there's a foot of snow drift, so um, where I am there, I've had to kick a foot of snow out the way, find roughly where the grass was before I could pitch and get some pegs in. But this is where I am. Um, lovely sunset at the minute. Got about half half an hour, 
fish. Come here, watch. Uh, maybe a bit less than. Ten to five. So, three minutes. If I'm lucky. So, I'm going to get the rest of my gear in the tent. Get my map blown up. Uh, get some gloves on because my bloody hands are freezing. <laughs> Do you know what I mean by snow drifts? Ooh. There we go. The tent's all set up. I've got a little while before the sun's completely set. And I've got some brand new insulated waterproof gloves. So what can I do with my bit of spare time before the sun's set? And what and what can I do to try out my new gloves? snowman mate for the night uh, need to give him some eyes and a, a mouth and a nose I don't know what I've got I haven't got any carrots and coal uh, I'll have to think about that one there we go Mr Peanut Face Mr Peanut Face is going to keep me company tonight isn't he mate Morning everybody. Oh, it's a chilly one, but I had a really, really good night's sleep. I've got to say, if, if anybody's on the fence about those firmer rest pads, then 
that, that, that thing is brilliant. I didn't feel the cold f through the ground once with that thing. That is, I'm amazed at how, how good that actually is. I've been sleeping on snow all night and I haven't felt the cold through the ground once. And, and that Rab sleeping bag as well, it's, it's amazing how, how well it does. Yeah, brilliant night's sleep. So anyway, I've woke up nice and early, go and get that sunrise. So uh, yeah, let's go and check that out. down there somewhere in the tent oh look at this morning uh, um, cloud inversions all that over there look amazing I'm missing the sunrise I want to do a time lapse What an absolutely beautiful morning this is. <laughs> it is stunning. It's been so many years since I've experienced snow like this. What I had the other week when I was in Princetown was, was, only, a, was only a light dusting compared to this. Just taking the last of it before I start packing away and heading home because <laughs> where I live, down over that way, no, no snow to be seen, just green fields as far as you can see. <laughs> There's one thing that I want to do before I head home and that is to make a snow angel. So I hope there's no, no poo back there.
The snow was too hard. <laughs> Can't say I didn't try. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm all packed away. This is where I was. Hopefully you can see what I'm pointing at because I can't see the screen because my phone's dying. <laughs> this is where I was. I would normally say leave no trace but I kind of have left a trace today but it's not a trace that's in a bad way. That Once I, the snow's fallen you'll never know I'm here so yeah as always leave no trace. Not a trace that's gonna impact the environment, you know, rubbish and all the rest of it. That's what you mean by leave no trace. Bye bye, Mr. Peanut Face. Have a nice time. Enjoy the rest of your life. Okay, there we go. So I'm going to say goodbye from here. My battery is literally on, literally on its last legs. It's not going to last much longer. So I'll say bye from here. Uh, if you've made it to this far, thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed seeing a snowy Dartmoor and you've enjoyed watching my camp. I've had a really good time. I've had a really good weekend. Two really good days with the, <coughs> the, the protest in Cornwood and that camp on Showtop and then yes tour by Will Hayes in the snow what a fantastic weekend I've had really really good so yeah I really hope you've enjoyed watching it if you've enjoyed it give it the old big fat thumbs up as usual <coughs> thank you very much uh, if you haven't subscribed then subscribe and I will see you on the next one Thank you very, very much for watching. Bye.